Holly, over to you now. How are we looking outside this morning? You know, pretty similar. It's a different day of the week, but here at 518, we are, you guessed it, talking about more of the same. Cloud cover around, temperatures steady in the 30s. We've got a few flurries, and we're even going to throw in a sun peak or two because, my goodness, can we use it. And we saw a little bit of that yesterday. It is Thursday. It is January the 7th, and our timeline showing mainly cloudy skies, peaks of sunshine. Doesn't really pick up on the flurry chances, but they are there. So don't be off card if you see a few snowflakes again. And you are all in the 30s. Remember those normal highs in the mid 30s, and that's where most of you are already. And we should be in the low 20s. So we're feeling much better than that. We're just not climbing at all. And then as far as the winds, we remain fairly light. Five, 10 miles an hour sustained more or less, which makes it really comfortable to be outdoors if you're dressed for it. The regional view will show a lot of overcast skies, but you can also see some breaks closer to home here and those few flurries. So this is the same pattern that we've had in place all week long. And on your national design mark forecast, as you see the clock moving behind me, nothing else really changes. We stay steady in the 30s with those overcast skies and just isolated flurry chances as we head through today. Subaru seven day outlook tomorrow is Friday and we are still anticipating at least a little more sunshine as we head into tomorrow and Saturday. It'll still be mixed though. We'll call it intervals of clouds and sun and then staying in the 30s and seeing a little more sunshine, Maureen, as we head into the middle of next week.